Here's the field for the fourth race, tonight's fourth race, the fourth leg of the Hill Farms Pacing Series for two-year-old Colts and Gildings. Racing one mile, a purse of $3,000. Number one is Erend. Held by Peter and Gail McCann of Groveport. Chad Norman trains for Jeff Fout. The two ready bunny. Bill Sanders, the owner, Tyloy trains for Brad Hanners. Three tough dragon, owned by Sam Noble Jr. of Cedarville. Chip Noble, the trainer driver. The four Met Arts log with a Star Country stable and Benny Holler of Chillicothe. Dan Ader, the trainer driver. Five cigarettes, shown by the HCA stable of Wilmington. Daryl Lewis, the trainer, Mark Winter, is in the bike. Number six, Henry's Manor, owned by Bruce and Mary Jean Walls of Greenville. Bruce Walls is the trainer for Don Irvine, Jr. And the seven, Bar K. Jesse, up at the Beretti Cook stable of North Caldwell, New Jersey. Melanie Williams trains and drives. One play show perfecta and a pick three wagering. The first leg of the pick three. Eight minutes now remain until post time. The fourth leg of the Hill Farms Pacing Series, lining up and moving in. They swing to the back stretch. There they go. And uh, they're off, and there's four of them away here. Toff Dragon outstepping the rest on the outside. Cigarette is right there towards the inside. It's ready. Bunny in from off the pylon comes Aaron. And they're four across as they fire into that first turn. Early fifth at the inside. It's Matt Arts long. Then there's a big gap, some four lengths to Henry's Manor and Barkey Jesse is the early trailer seventh. They approach the first quarter, and Tough Dragon is the early pace setter, but Cigarette, a content challenger on the outside, wants the front end. 26 and three, the opening quarter, and Cigarette on the outside will now look to back down in, but he won't have anything to do with that. Tough Dragon on the inside, and these two are going at it early as they swing into the clubhouse turn. Tough Dragon takes that lead, and finally Cigarette will drop in behind. Aaron is for the back racing a third with Reddy Bunny in line fourth. Matt Arts Log is fifth a half, 56 and three. Despite that uh, sluggish second quarter there, they're still string out a bit with Tough Dragon showing the way. Cigarette of the inside racing a second. Aaron now closing the gap nicely in front of him third. And here comes Reddy Bunny to the outside with a burst of speed fourth. And Henry's Manor takes that cover fifth. Matt Arts Log is sixth and the trailer is Barkey Jesse and again, uh, Cigarette and uh, Top Dragon are slugging it out. Again, they're stride for stride as they reach the three quarters together in 127. And Top Dragon, the inside advantage here, continues a lead. But Cigarette is a pesky second. At the rail is Aaron. Out of the outside, Ready Bunny. And poised to strike three wide now is Henry's Manor as they turn for home. But it's all Top Dragon. He's led throughout, but he's been pressured the entire way. And Cigarette is still there. Out of the outside, here comes Henry's Manor. Down to the inside is Aaron and a late closing bar K Jesse, but it's Tough Dragon uh, grinding it out here. Tough Dragon wins by a length in 158. Fourth race official here is the winner, the fourth leg of the Hill Farms Pacing Series. Number three, Tough Dragon. A uh, son of Dragon's Lair from the Niatros Mirror, tough and tender. Owned by Sam Noble Jr. of Cedarville, Ohio. Sam Chip Noble III, the uh, trainer and driver. His very first career win in his third career start. That is enough for a record tonight, 158 flats. The 3-5 perfecto paying $14.60, 1460.